Hi, in this video we're going through how to add a custom menu to the sidebar on your WordPress website. My name's Dan and this is WP Updo. Welcome, my name's Dan, I'm a senior software engineer and full stack WordPress developer with WP Updo. And in this video we're going through how to add a custom menu to your WordPress sidebar, which should apply across the vast majority of your site in one go. So the first thing we need to do is head to the dashboard. You can see here I am already logged in. Now, if you're not logged in, there is a link in the description below which will take you through how to do it. Once we're there, head over to Appearance. Now, mouse over, not click, and then head to Menus. And if you cannot see this, it means your account doesn't have access to it, in which case you'll need to ask your website administrator for an elevated account, or they may need to do this for you. But mouse over Appearance, head to Menus, and then click that one. Now we've already got the custom footer in, we've already got the main menu, but I'm going to add an additional menu in, which is fairly straightforward. What we wanna do is hit the create a new menu link there. I'm going to call this sidebar quick links, and then hit create menu. Now this can be called anything you like. Uh, then what we're going to do is add a few links here. So. We'll start by heading down to the, well, we're on the pages there. We want to go to view all. I'm going to pop the home. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to link to a couple of special categories. So let's head to categories. Let's have tech, sorry, breaking tech and entertainment news on the quick links on the left hand side. There we go, and we can see they're in, and of course breaking is most important, and then entertainment and tech can come after that one. Once you're done there, click on the blue save menu button, and that's step one dealt with. The next thing we need to do is add the menu to the sidebar itself. So we can do a, so we can head over to, again, we should already be in appearance, head to customize on the left hand side. And let's go into one of our articles so we can see the sidebar more easily. So we've got the sidebar here, which we're going to edit. And what we want to do is head over to widgets. Now this could be sidebar, it could be called uh, the front page or a post sidebar, but in this case, it's widgets. If you can't find the widgets icon, then just have a look through some of the other options until you see something that looks about right. Into widgets. We have main sidebar on the right hand side here. And again, this may be called something different for you. It really depends on your theme, but that's all good. And what we're going to do is add a new block in here. So we just mouse over and gently mouse over until you see these new add blocks. I want to pop that in after the search, I think is probably going to be a good spot. And we're adding a title to start with. So a heading. And we're going to call that quick links. And then after that heading, we're going to add a menu. We want the navigation menu. And then that gives us the opportunity to select whichever menu we've created. So we're going to use sidebar quick links in this case. That's good to go. Now we can hit publish. That's done. And we now have the quick links and the three categories we've created. Once we're happy with that, click on the little X and then we can go back out to the front page of the site and just confirm that it's all working as expected. Try and click on that one again. There we go. There we are. So that's breaking entertainment and tech. So let's head to the entertainment news. And there we go. That is working as expected. So thank you very much for watching. Check out the videos on the left hand side for some more WordPress tips. Or if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell so YouTube lets you know every time we post a new vid. Stay safe, wash your hands, and we'll see you in the next video.